Each week, I'm going to do a segment called The Fabulous Five. We go the top five rookie performers of the week. Let's get it started for week one. And it's the first wide receiver selected in the 2022 NFL Draft. Ladies and gentlemen, Drake London comes hey. in at number five. Big body Drake London, six foot four, towers over everyone, high school basketball superstar. Did not do much in the preseason or training camp. We didn't even know. And then he shows up, and Drake London's all over the field in week one against the Saints. Mariota's guy. Remember, you look at Kyle Pitts, two catches. Drake London, five catches. All over the field in this one, making plays, looking like a giant tower. And then the after the catch that he can do was seeking out contact. Kyle, that could have been an angry run no right doubt. there. No Drake doubt. London, fantastic. Led the Falcons in receptions in week one. Second most receiving yards ever by an Atlanta Falcon in his NFL debut. Is that right? Yes. Wow. Number four, let's go to the Windy City where it was wet and it was wild and a rookie defensive lineman named Dominique Robinson let's makes go. our list. Kyle, you profiled him earlier this week. Dominique Robinson, number 91. Uh, that, wait, who is that against? Yeah, ah, ah. That's the greatest left tackle in the sport. That's right. And that's a guy in his first career start getting a sack after lining up against Trent Williams in the rain. Dominique Robinson is a fifth round pick out of the University of Miami of Ohio. And he's born, this might be weird, we might be talking about this, and huh? Canton, Ohio. That's where oh. he's from. Ooh, Dominique Robinson, sneaky. Canton, Ohio, okay. Hall of Fame player. We'll see. Uh, <laughs> Dominique Robinson, great performance. First career game, sack and a half, was all over the field and limited action on snaps and actually beat Trent Williams for a sack. Sorry. So don't look at me, Trent. If you think <laughs> that was he didn't beat me. He, uh, Trent, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Put it on the put it on the resume. Uh, number three, we go to Rutgers with the 251st overall pick in the 2022 NFL Draft. A seventh round selection. His name, Isaiah Pacheco. Let's go. Isaiah Pacheco had 10 carries in the blowout over the Arizona Cardinals, and this was his first career touchdown. He scores. He spikes it. He's having a moment. Watch number 15 here. Watch number 15. He's like, no, no, no. No, Pop, that's his nickname. Pop, you're going to be in the league for a long time. You're going to want this ball. Mahomes picks up the ball. Hey, hey, Pop, 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 Pop. Pop. Me, man. Pop, it's me, Mahomes. Here's your ball. <laughs> Go and get it. Uh, Pacheco, let's look at the leading rushers from all the rookies. We did all this Damian Pierce and Brees Hall talk on the show. Uh, what? Hey. Oh. Pacheco led all rookie rushers yeah. in week like one. It. This guy is going to be a player tonight to watch. I promise you, he's in the game plan. Number 10, wearing Tyreek's old number, Isaiah Pacheco, you can't miss him. Our list is different than every other list in the league. We go all over the roster. And number two on this week's list happens to be a kicker. Yeah. Let's go! Oh, hey. Cade York! Hey. Cade York! There he this is. guy right here, a fourth round pick. People freaked out. Wait. From 58 yards for the game! We could have gone in from 70. That was insane. <laughs> Cade York at LSU bombs a kick for the game winner here. The Browns took him in the fourth round, and I'm telling you, when I was at the draft, people were melting down. I remember us being shocked on the stage. Actually, let's go back to that moment. Okay. Day three of the draft, the Browns take a kicker in the fourth round. Take it away, Rich Eisen. With the 124th pick, in the 2022 NFL Draft, the Cleveland Browns select Cade York, yes. kicker, LSU. All right. Yes. All right. We've got a kicker. It's Cade York. Yes. Split the uprights, Cade. First game, bombs one from 70, and is now the hero of Cleveland. All right. I love, like, coaching trees. Do you guys know who Jamie Cole is? Jamie Cole is like the kicker's coach of kicker's coaches, okay? He is the guy. Look at this alumni he has in the league. Then when you want to be a pro kicker, you go to Jamie Cole, you go to Harrison Bucker, huge like Justin Tucker. How about McPherson? Guess who, guess who Jamie Cole was training with? Cade York. He's part of the crew. Look at the names at the bottom of the punters. Wow. We got Johnny Hecker, and then we got McAfee. This is like a long, yeah. long tradition of Jamie Cole guys in the league. McAfee, if you're watching, shout out Jamie Cole on your show. This is Let's the guy. Here we go. Cade York, Cade York, part of the Cole Kicking Academy. But he's not number one on the list this uh -huh. week. He's not number one. Number, week, number one on this week's Fabulous Five. We go to Happy Valley. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then we go uh -huh. to our nation's capital. Uh -huh. Jahan Dotson's number wow. one on our list. Go ahead, go ahead, Jahan Dotson. 
Uh, this is the guy for all the rookies who stood out the most. He is the most fabulous of the fabulous five. Jahan Dotson, two different touchdown catches. This one, a huge game-changing one. After the game, we had the highlight. Like, Wentz is, like, winking to the camera. He should be thanking Jahan Dotson. <laughs> Jahan Dotson was the dude. And if you look at this cool list here, first career games, two touchdowns. Last 10 seasons, not a long list. Alan Hearn, Jalen Strong, Kenny Galladay, Marquise Brown a couple years ago in what was like a 60 to two, uh, 62 to seven blowout. Jahan Dotson's comes in a close game against the Jaguars where they pulled it out at the end. He was the dude. Jahan Dotson came on our show before the draft, came on our show before the season. Wonderful young man. And I love seeing him number one on our oh, list. Yeah. Friend of the show, Jahan oh, yeah. Dotson. Uh -huh. Let's see the fabulous five oh, yes. here. Jahan Dotson, if you had asked me to write this list before week one, probably wasn't gonna go this way here. We've got, <laughs> Wide receiver going here, okay? A kicker going here, a seventh round pick here, a fifth round pick here, and then we bookend it. Two top wideouts from the college game, Drake London. Kyle Brandt, the first edition of the Fabulous Five. What do you yeah. got? It has been several years since the NFL's had a week one game without a rookie co starting quarterback, yeah. and that's why we got these guys. Peter, I'm looking at number two. Uh, it's just unleashing a bomb to beat the Panthers. Peter, it's been a long time since we've had a high profile rookie named Cade. Can you name the last one? <laughs> I'm a Cade McNown guy. I, I am. I am. <laughs> to this day. I'm a Cade McNown guy. To the lefty quarterback at a 99 UCLA. draft to the Bears. But will, Cade York is back. I will say this about Cade York the guys love him. And the story out of Cleveland was that he was missing everything in pregame. Oh, like, missing no. everything. He's yeah. down there, oh, yeah. Carolina, nervous, just shanking everything. Hey, like, ah! Tell you it was great in pregame. Brandon McManus couldn't miss a thing. <laughs> Very fair oh, point. Oh, man. 58 <laughs> yards, Cade York. What do you guys got? Oh, man. Jahan Dotson. Didn't he have three catches, Peter, in that game? And then just two of them were yeah, touchdowns. Just awesome. casual it's red it. zone guy. No, no big, big deal. Zone. Huge red zone guy. Give me the rock. Yeah. I have a fellow Scarlet Knight on the list. I, I want to go there, but I need Jamie Cole's info. I want to send my son. He's six. Okay. And I want I want him to be the next great kicker. So yeah, I need go. that info. Look, he needs to attend these. We have Tom House on the network, the quarterback coach. We have Steve Clarkson. We have Jordan Palmer. Yes. Let's get Jamie Cole some love. Yes. The, kicking, the kicking guru. Let's go. Let's go. Incredible. Oh, Peter, it's a great list. Fabulous.